hello guys and welcome back so in the previous video we have added the ledge movement now if you notice the player can now not jump off the ledge unless we want to okay but if you notice when the player is on the ledge the player can still walk okay we want to stop this as well and for example if we face that direction as you can see the player can't see in that direction so we need to prevent these two issues now so first of all let's deal with this rotation okay as you can see for this on our player script when we say that if the movement amount is greater than zero then in third case we rotate the player around the environment so right here we will add another condition and in this one we will say that if the move dir or move direction magnitude is greater than 0 0.2 as well then we will allow the player to rotate okay so now if we save this and get back to unity now if we play the game and now let's try to jump on this obstacle and you can now face in that direction but if you want to move to this direction as you can see now the player is not changing the facing okay if we move to that direction and to this one as well okay as you can see now the player can see in all of the directions now we want to stop the movement okay as you can see the player still moves when on the ledge okay so we need to stop this so on the player script right here as you can see when we take input from the player then we make the player move okay so now we need to move this line from this player movement function and let's move this line to right here when the player is on the surface so we will paste it right here and then instead of the move amount we will use the velocity magnitude to give value to this movement float okay in the animator so we will say velocity dot magnitude and as you know that this movement value is a float and it take a value from 0 to 1 and this velocity magnitude value for now is not between 0 and 1 so we need to normalize this so what we will do we will divide this by the movement speed and that is it and make sure that you type this line above this velocity dot y okay so now if we save this again and get back to unity now let's play the game again Okay, now let's jump on this obstacle and you will notice that now the player just simply stop whenever we try to move the player but if we move in the backward direction as you can see the player moves to the backward direction but we can't move now okay unless we jump then we can be able to move as you can see so now these two issues is fixed as well and our jumping down parkour is in a perfect working condition we will be working further on this in the upcoming videos so let's just end this video right here